Welcome back to and this guide. In today's video, we are going to show you how to export chat DM history on Discord. Let's begin. Now, the first thing you need to do is to log in using your credentials. If this is your first time in Discord, click the register option and from here just follow the on-screen instructions and you're good to go. Exporting your chat history ensures that you have a backup of your conversations and it is very important if you have valuable or sentimental conversations that you don't want to lose because some users may want to keep a record of their conversations for legal or professional reasons. Exporting chat history allows you to maintain in an archive of your conversations for reference purposes because over time, old messages may get deleted or lost due to various reasons. If you switch devices or platforms, exporting chat history allows you to transfer your conversations seamlessly without losing any data. Now, it, the process of exporting chat DM mystery involves a few steps and I suggest you do this on the website or using the Discord Windows app because it's a lot it's gonna be difficult if you do this on the mobile device if you open the Discord app and the first step that we are going to take is go to this specific website now I need you to go to this specific website it's called dht chilex or colleagues.com okay and once you do that as you can see this is a discord history tracker hence dht right so let's say to save chat history in your servers groups and private conversations and view it offline of course there are two ways i believe there's two ways for you to be able to use the dht one is through the desktop app and one is through the browser now i'm gonna focus on the browser only and it says that i need to visit the page for the browser only version but however keep in mind that this version has significant limitations and fewer features but it, it doesn't matter because we're going to do that for this uh video only now it says here all right so the option one is you can use the user script this is the preferred option it requires a browser add-on but DHT will stay up to date and be, can be easily accessible in the Discord website. Install a user crypt manager add-on so it, it doesn't matter if you're using a different type of browsers. For example, if you're using Firefox, Edge, Chrome, Opera at this point, you might want to click on the Tamper Monkey. But I'm using the Chrome so I'm going to click on the Violet Monkey. And what will happen is I was forwarded to another page. Violent Monkey is built with the web extension API, so it supports a lot of browsers. But for now, I'm gonna click on the Chrome Web Store. And so much so, just click the Add to Chrome and Add Extension. Let's see how we can do it from here. Now, after downloading the uh, Google Chrome extension, the Violent Monkey, this is the next step. You need to click Install User Script to prompt an installation into the User Script Manager. I believe what it does is it's the one responsible for you to be able to download the data or export chat DM history. So let's do that. Let's install user script for now. Click on it. And once you do that, you I am directed here to another page. It's called installing script, script history, discord history tracker and a lot more. And then now for you to be able to install this one, I, I, I believe you need to click this install option. It, it says control and enter. Let's do that right now. And script installed, but doesn't give anything. All right. Now um, I'm gonna try to close it for now and see what happens. Now the next option is you need to open Discord and view any server group or private conversation. It will not appear in friends list. Mm, that's strange. But the, the thing is you need to click the DHT in the top right corner. So let's open Discord for now. And I'm going to the Andy Guides option. All right, very good. Now, you see the uh, DHT at the upper right corner. That's going to be this script. And what it does is... Now, let me click the DHT option. And from here, these are the settings. It is recommended to disable link and images previews to avoid putting unnecessary strain in your browser. All right, let's do that. 
now let me escape that for now and you have the option below at the bottom upload and combine settings start tracking download reset so let me just hover to the settings earlier all right that's it and if you click on the start tracking what will happen is it is going to i believe now once i clicked the start tracking it got like a small response here it says one message from one channel and for you to be able to export the dm mystery you need to click download now when i open the uh, dht text what happened is it's just numbers of characters and it's it's all like inaudible it's like deciphering poneglyphs but the thing is on the website it says when you hover to the bottom how to view history first save the viewer file to your computer then you can open the downloaded viewer in your browser click load file and select the archive to view so let me do that right now now this is the viewer and all i have to do is click the load file for me to be able to export the chat dm history okay so once it's loaded what will happen is let's click on it it says there are like 50 messages per page all right you can customize it to 100 messages per page to 50 500 and a thousand messages per page but if you wanted you can click on the all messages and the settings are again like you can customize it to image previews message formatting user avatars and animated emoji now let's click on this one now as you can see this is the message that we got from the specific server and again if you join a lot of servers you might want to do that as well and see how many export chats you can do on this amazing platform or third-party software all right and from here you can download this um gm history if you wanted let's click on it but the thing is if you click that you are going to be redirected to the image preview because you selected that on the settings right let's skip on it now that's the uh, browser usage only and when you go to the discord app for windows you see there's no dht option so basically if you wanted to work for that on the uh, desktop go again to the uh, kylex or chilex dht website and look for the uh, troubleshooting steps or the guidelines for using the uh, dht for discord app okay and basically that's how you export chat dm mystery on discord and again if you export dm mystery it provides users with flexibility and control and peace of mind regarding their conversation and it serves as documentation for agreements decisions or discussions that occurred in the past thank you so much for watching we will see you again in the next video